children to sit down. Stop it. Sit out. Sit down, Mama. Four eleven in the morning, and look who's up. This is how my day is starting off. Welcome to another vlog with all things Quita. It just feel like I haven't talked to you guys in a while. I guess I should update y'all on what's been going on in my life so far. As y'all seen, I was working out. Your girl done lost some weight, okay? I've been losing weight. Your girl about to get skinny, y'all. <laughs> oh my gosh, let me grow up, grow up. I work out about two times a day and I pretty much do OMAD. Only one meal a day. Got my weights here, I got these from Target. So let's get into the shebang. A few of you have been asking me, where do I work? Well, the reason I have not revealed where I work is because I read my employee handbook extensively. From what I understood, I am not a spokesperson for my job. By me revealing where I work, I've taken on a role that they did not appoint to me. The company that I work for knows all about this YouTube channel. They've been knowing about the YouTube channel. I don't do anything on this channel that goes against the employee handbook. I don't show you guys any charts. I don't show you guys any information that would make me violate HIPAA. I don't do any of those things. And I did talk to my supervisor about going more in detail, not showing you guys the charts, not showing you anything as it relates to the clients that my companies provide services for. I did ask if I could, of course, blur my screens, not show any private information, not reveal where I work. And as I'm coding, telling you guys the codes that I'm coding if I send a query to you guys why I send a query. Well, <clears throat> upper management and also the legal department both agreed that they could not allow that. They were not upset, you know, anything like that. It's just they not going to allow it. So it's nothing that I can do about that. My hands are tied. I'm sorry, you guys. I can't do that. And when they told me, it was a bummer. I truly wanted to do that because I feel like it'll give you guys a better sense of what a day is like. At first, I was disappointed about it. And I was going to not do the videos all together. Right after I read the response from upper management, I ended up getting two comments from Redefining Morgan. Hey, Morgan. <laughs> Basically, the gist of what he said, and he said, watching you has kept me motivated while I'm in school and shows me it is possible. And when I saw that, I was like, I got to figure out something else. I'm going to have to get creative. There's about to be a shift in my channel. So I'm going to still bring you Day in the Life of a Medical Code of Videos, but I'm going to have to get creative with how I bring y'all the content. And you should also already see the shift in the content now, because if you're watching this video, then you see the other video that's posted about a vision board so yeah i'm bringing you guys medical code and content but also other things i look at it as a blessing and this is going to give me more time to focus on my business i started a company i'm really excited about it i love it more than medical coding as i should it's my company i am going to be documenting my journey and being my own boss a lot of you guys say that you feel inspired i want you to feel inspired i want you to feel motivated i want you to feel like i can do this but yeah that's the situation so for those y'all 
who've been rocking with me, thank you for rocking with me. And for those of you all who are new, thank you for subscribing. I appreciate it. I hope that you all enjoy the new content that is coming to the channel and support your girl you know what i'm saying watch my vision board video do me a favor comment on my vision board video and just give me your thoughts tell me what you think because i don't know if you like it if you don't tell me so it's like i don't want to make the video and then you guys don't really come and i'm like oh they didn't like the video what am i do now you know so just comment show me some love let's go on and get into the video Okay, I almost forgot to show y'all my root operation cards. I got them in the mail from Libman Education because I was not understanding root operations, y'all. Yes, I got them all in the mail. I'm so glad to have them. This is going to definitely assist me with my CCS. only paid $19.99 for them. If you want these, just go on LibmanEducation.com and you can get these cards. Let me go ahead and get to work and code these charts. So I just discovered something. I'm finna show y'all how to print on the index cards, but I'll come across this video by, this is it right here. So it says ICD-10 root operations cards and her name right there is Jessica Lee. So she made her very own root operation cards. I wish, the lighting is so bad. I, anyways, I wish I saw this video before I ordered my cards. I could have made these cards and not paid a dime and i can't believe she's not selling these cards they're free she has a link to the cards and you can print them so these right here are three by fives the cards that she's using in this video is three by eight so that's the link right here that i clicked and it took me here to canva and this is the first card that she has listed so we're going to go ahead and print out this first card so First, let me go ahead and load my printer with the index card. So at least I can show you guys how to do that. You guys know that I'm a mom with kids. So you may hear some background noise. I'm a mother. So yeah, kids are out for summer. Oh, I'm gonna Sorry guys, that was my mother. All right, so let me cut on this printer. So I got the printer on and what I'm gonna do is open it up and I'm gonna remove the paper out of here. So I'm gonna put the lines facing up. So I like to do it like this and I go ahead and close it like that and then I push it down. I don't do it the other way first because I, sometimes I not have it lined up correctly. So I do it like that, so I'm gonna insert that. So then now I have to, ugh, it's not showing up on the camera. I'm gonna have to modify the paper size. So I'm gonna hit that and see right here how it says uh, wait, paper size. Okay, so let's see. Um, right here, three by five. My index cards are three by five inches. I'm gonna select that size. So if you get the five by eight index cards, select five by eight. But I have three point. I mean three by five. So I'm gonna select that. I had to do that first before I sent the print job over here. So let's go back to the computer. So I'm just going to print one card right now. So I'm going to go here and I'm going to go to print. So change it to landscape. It is printing. For some reason, when I print straight from the Canva site, this is how it printed and this is not going to work. So 
we're going to incorporate Microsoft Word and that should fix the issue. So we're gonna take this right here. It will not allow me to get the triangles or the numbers. I was only able to highlight this, so I have that already copied. So we go over here to Word, we're gonna do Command V. So it's all here and you see it's too big now. So we need to change the layout to landscape. So we're gonna go to layout, orientation, landscape. All right, so I put the top, uh, the title at the top where it says root operation index cards. I need to uh, change the size to three by five to match my printer settings. So here go 3.5 right there. Now we're gonna change the actual size of the font, 7.5. Okay, so they all fit with 7.5. We're gonna change the margins. So I'm gonna do custom margins and do 0.4. We're gonna do command P, push it, and we're gonna do print. Hopefully this works. <laughs> Mommy girl. Yeah, she wanna get out of here. Mommy girl. I'm doing something good. Look. Okay, and that's perfect. If you run into issues like I did on printing them out, just do what I did and you shouldn't have any problems. You might have to alter it, but um, you can make it work for you. Now that I'm done with the index cards, I'm about to show y'all my new vacuum because I know a lot of you that watch the channel, you are moms with kids and this device will make your life so much easier i have the bissell cross wave i got this one from walmart it was like it was 199 now there's some confusion because they also sell the same one at target but the one at target is green and white but from what i've learned both devices are identical it's just that the blue color is exclusive to Walmart, which is freaking confusing. So I'm gonna unbox it and I'm gonna show you guys how it works because this will make your life so much easier as being a mom. And some of you work from home and stuff like that and you're just gonna just love that this is something that you can use really, really quickly. You probably can mop your uh, floors on a lunch break real, real fast. So uh, let's unbox it. So I'm gonna have to unbox this on the table because that's the only way I can get a good angle where I can show y'all me unboxing this see the bottom it sweeps and mops if your child spills a bowl of cereal this is all you need and they do have a cordless version for like 130 dollars more and i was like now i'm about to give it a try this is probably going to scare my baby you have an option for rug and hardwood floor we're gonna do hardwood so i'm gonna hit the glad I bought it. It was worth every penny and it's going to make my life easier. crazy y'all i'm so pooped right now i still have to finish i have to i haven't eaten dinner yet y'all it's 9 26 i usually don't eat after eight o'clock i just didn't get around to eating i've been busy as far as my ccs journey i'm behind some courses because i have been busy and i just haven't had time i'm in a pretty bad spot because the issue is the program that i'm in i I'm gonna be honest, I'm not really, I don't I don't think it's for me. I'm trying to make it work. I'm trying to make the program work because I've already spent my money on it. But if 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 this doesn't work out, I'm gonna have to end up purchasing a different program to prepare for the CCS. So that's the situation that I'm in and it's been tough. And I pretty much I can't say I gave up on the course, but the course just didn't seem for me and it's just been it's just been hard take 
get personal, but I ain't lying. I ain't hiding, I've been grinding, multiplying. I've been trying to get my weight up, staying prayed up, meditating and taking time away. You always posting up pictures, trying to look like you're winning. I'm writing rhymes in the kitchen, soaking in moments we live in, yeah. You got the nerve to be on me, faking your life for the IG. If you got my number, don't add me, cause baby, I'm on hiatus. I'm on hiatus. I'm on hiatus. I'm on hiatus. Uh oh. Baby, don't check for me. Taking time out. Crock-Pot beef ribs with my sweet potato and my vegetables that I just steamed and I forgot to get me some cinnamon for my sweet potato but it's all right so I'm about to have my dinner finally <sighs> so y'all it is 11 21 and I have to work out I work out twice a day and I haven't hit all my steps today my minimum amount that I'm supposed to hit every day is 10,000 steps so I gotta get to it <sighs> Thank you. 